today we're going to look at multiplying fractions. We're going to use fraction circles and drawings to help us. For our first one, we're going to work out a third multiplied by a half. This is the same as saying a third of a half, so the answer is going to be smaller than a half. I'm going to use fraction circles to help me. I have a half circle. Multiplying it by one third means I need to split my half into thirds or three pieces. If I look at my other fraction circles, I can see that I can fit three sixths onto my half. So a third of a half equals one sixth. If we look at the calculation, we can see that if we multiply the numerators together, we get one times one, which is one. And if we multiply the denominators together, we get three times two is six. So one third multiplied by one half equals one sixth. I can also draw a diagram to help me. Here I've split a rectangle into halves. A third of a half means I need to split my half into thirds. So a third times a half equals one sixth. Here is another example. I have worked out one quarter multiplied by one third, which is the same as a quarter of a third. We can see from the fraction circles and the drawing that a quarter of a third equals one twelfth. If we look at our calculation, if we multiply the numerators together, we get one. And if we multiply the denominators together, we get twelve. Why don't you have a go at using fraction circles or draw the shapes yourself? I hope you have found that useful. If you did, please like my video and subscribe to my channel. See you all soon. Bye!